Taylor from Chevro Mist Kennels. Okay, so what is PRA? Well, PRA stands for progressive retinal atrophy, which can lead to different degrees of blindness in dogs. While some affected dogs might develop night blindness, others can become completely blind, or they may not become blind at all. The good news is that PRA isn't a very common condition amongst most dogs and is more likely to be seen in some breeds compared to others. Toy and mini poodles have a higher incidence of PRA than most breeds. Testing for PRA is becoming more common and a test result can come back in one of three ways. The first type of test result can be what's referred to as clear, which means the dog carries two copies of a healthy gene. The second type of test result can be what's referred to as a carrier. This means the dog carries one copy of a healthy gene and one copy of a bad gene. The final type of test result is what we call affected, and this means the dog has two copies of the bad gene. Now, because PRA is a recessive trait, a dog must have two copies of the gene that causes PRA in order to be affected. One copy of the bad gene comes from mum and the other from dad. Dogs that are clear or carriers will not be affected by PRA, while dogs that are affected may suffer from some form of vision impairment later in life. All our cleared puppies have come from a tested father that is clear, so he cannot produce an affected dog regardless of the mother's test, so we only require one parent to be tested in order to ensure the puppies are not affected. In our experience, we found that PRA is extremely rare in most breeds and especially amongst the designer dog crosses. In fact, we're proud to say that we have never had a single case of PRA in any of our puppies. So why are some breeders testing for PRA? Well, even though PRA is rare, testing provides that extra assurance. I hope that information has helped you understand PRA a little better, but if you have any questions, contact us and speak with one of our very friendly and highly trained staff.